one of the biggest myths that we hear is that if you want to make more horsepower with E85, you have to tune for it. That is not true. Matt from Eflex Fuel here, and in today's video, we're going to be teaching you why you can install one of our E85 kits, head straight to the E85 pumps, and why you will make more horsepower and torque. Zero tuning involved whatsoever. So the first reason on our list, people talk about E85 and high octane rating, and that's true. So E85 has a chemical octane rating of between 96 to 100 AKI. AKI stands for anti-knock index. It's basically just how we measure octane in the US. So you combine this chemical octane with the charge cooling impact, the effective octane of E85 is something like 115. Now the reason this matters, when you're driving on gasoline, even premium gasoline, there's knock occurring, knocks happening. So the Mopars are great for this because Mopars have knock sensors that report knock voltage and you can actually read that via OBD. We have customers all the time that will say, even when they're on premium gas, they're reading some knock voltage. Now what happens when there's knock voltage? ECU's pulling timing. When you're pulling timing, you're losing horsepower and losing torque. Now these customers install an E-Flex kit, start running E85 with proper fueling, thanks to our kit. What happens to that knock voltage? It goes to zero. When you have zero knock voltage, the ECU pulls no timing. You're getting maximum horsepower and torque from your ECU and engine combination, what it was set up for. Now the second reason, we touched on it a little bit, it's gonna be the charge cooling impact of ethanol. So what is charge cooling? Charge cooling is essentially when the air charge entering the combustion chamber is cool and cooled dramatically. Now the reason this happens, the science behind it, when a liquid turns into a gas, when it evaporates or vaporizes, it absorbs the surrounding heat. Ethanol absorbs 2.4 times the amount of heat that gasoline absorbs during vaporization. So what this means is the air in your combustion chamber, the heat is being pulled out of it as the ethanol in E85 is going from a liquid to a gas during vaporization. So intake air temperatures will drop when you're running E85. We've seen anywhere from 15 to 30 degrees Fahrenheit. Some sources say up to 200 degree Fahrenheit drop in IATs. You can't measure these IATs because they're happening immediately after injection. Usually you have an IAT sensor somewhere on the intake rather than just before combustion, <laughs> essentially. Um, but what happens is when the IATs drop so much, the air is denser. Denser air drives more efficiency. More efficiency means more performance. So that's the second reason why E85 with proper fueling delivers more performance. Now the third reason, it's gonna be flame propagation rate. So flame propagation rate is basically the speed at which the flame front moves after ignition. So it's like how fast the flame is moving. So ethanol has a flame propagation rate of 4.5 meters per second. Gasoline has a flame propagation rate of 3.8 meters per second. Now I'll try to put some graphics on the screen here from an MIT study about this, but basically quicker flame propagation rate reduces the time to reach full compression in the cylinder. The ultimate outcome of that is a slightly shorter duration of combustion. These factors all indicate more efficiency. When you're going for maximum performance, you want maximum efficiency. And that's why the flame propagation rate is the third reason on our list today why E85 with proper fueling will deliver more horsepower and torque compared to gasoline. Now the fourth reason on our list is gonna be oxygen content. Now the oxygenation of E85 doesn't contribute by itself to higher horsepower, but it kind of builds on these other factors. So E85 oxygen content is about 30%, whereas gasoline, it's usually between zero to 3.5% oxygen. When you have such a large oxygen percentage in your fuel, it ensures, you know, like we're saying, a complete combustion. Complete combustion means an efficient combustion. And you're using all of the energy from that fuel that is combusting or igniting when you have complete combustion, thanks to that high oxygen content. So you combine these four reasons together with proper fueling from an E-Flex fuel kit, and you fill up with E85, and you will make more horsepower and make more torque, zero tuning involved whatsoever. Now, the numbers, we could talk about it all we want, <laughs> but the results are really what prove it. We try to put as many vehicles on the dyno as possible. Whether it's an NA4 Banger Civic or a Hellcat Red Eye, 
or a Toyota Tundra with a 5.7 with a supercharger kit, a Jeep Wrangler, uh, the list goes on. The point is we're trying to prove with proper fueling, the engine configuration doesn't matter. You run E85, you will make more power than gas. NA, forced induction, so supercharged, turbocharged, compound charge, um, four cylinder, six cylinder, eight cylinder, 10 cylinder, V12. When you run E85, you're gonna make more power. That's just the science. And that wraps it up. Those are the main reasons why you run an E-Flex fuel kit, you can fill up with E85, gas, any mixture of the two, it automatically adjusts, but you're gonna wanna fill up with E85 because you're gonna be making more power. And that's where the fun is.